In this video, we're going to talk about some of the additional field options or advanced bread options. So if we do go ahead and go back to our bread for our products and we go to database and then we want to edit bread, you can see that we have some optional details over here and there is a JSON editor. So if we then go to the documentation, you can find some of these additional field options. And there are some additional options that you can include for different types such as text or text box, a checkbox, drop down, radio button, images, and dates. There's also a bunch of other cool stuff you can do like validation, adding a description, and even generating slugs. So let's go ahead and take a look at one of the image options. If we scroll down, you can see here that we can resize the image, we can set the quality, we can choose to upsize it if we want, and we can also create some thumbnails. So let's go ahead and just resize an image. So let's say when a user uploads an image, we then want to resize this, and let's say that we want it to be resized to maybe a width of 300 pixels. So let's go ahead and paste that in, click on save, and what I want to do first is to show you inside of our media manager, inside of our products table, and the month and year, we have this image that we uploaded originally before. And you can see that this is 770 by 433 pixels. So we're going to update that image or edit that product. So we're gonna edit that product and then we are going to upload the same image and then click on save. And now if we go back to the media manager and we go back into that folder, you can now see that we have a MacBook Pro 1, and you can see that this image is going to be 300 pixels. So it's 300 pixels by 169, because we said that we wanted to resize the image. And sure enough, if we were to go back to our products, and we open this in a new tab, you can see that that is the image that is loading for that product. So with the additional field options or advanced spread options, you can use the JSON editor to add all these advanced options to any row in the bread builder.